Just in tonight, a woman accused of killing her estranged husband has posted bond, and right now she's in the process of being released from jail. Carolyn Court is accused of shooting Ray Court at the home that they shared before their separation. Tonight, we are learning more about him from the friends who knew him well. Channel 2's Mario Diaz live in the Northwest Houston neighborhood where this deadly shooting happened. Mario? Dominique, neighbors say that Ray Court pretty much kept to himself here. He would come and go quite often, but wouldn't say much to them. With regards to his wife, Carolyn Court, they would see her out here in her yard working at least once a week, waving to cars and to people as they pass by, and at the same time, even helping out the Girl Scouts on occasion, which is why everyone in this neighborhood is shocked over what took place here. Uh, you just... <laughs> kind of just took us by surprise. Reaction to the shocking end of Ray and Carolyn Court's marriage. Together till death did them apart. Carolyn charged with her estranged husband's murder. She claims an unintentional gunshot was fired during a disagreement inside their home. Ray had arrived minutes earlier driving his new girlfriend's vehicle. <laughs> Sorry. Just a great guy. Mark Clark had a tough time describing his friend Ray. It was only a few days ago the two had connected in person. When was the last time you saw him? Uh, last week. The loss of a 25-year friendship, difficult to absorb. What made him so special that he moved you to tears just now? You just have to know him. You know, he's just compassionate and... If you didn't like his product, he said I'd give you something else. Court owned and operated Gourmet Foods of Houston for over 40 years with Carolyn, according to her court appearance. The food delivery service had Ray traveling as far east as Beaumont and out west towards Bryan. Known to many, including Eugene Gill as... Just called him the Gourmet Food Guy. And always in great spirits when making sales calls. Uh, he was just like one of the guys. You know, he called on all the car dealers and, um, you know, just, just a great person. However, back on the home front, drastic changes had taken place in recent months. A marriage of over 40 years had gone sideways. I knew when they separated and, you know, but that's just some personal stuff I had to keep to myself. Sorry. Still many questions surrounding this case. Now, as Channel 2 Investigates has learned, Carolyn Court posted bond in the last hour. She is being booked out, which means she's in the process of being released here over the next course of several hours. Her next due date in court is Wednesday. Live in Northwest Houston, Mario Diaz, KPRC, Channel 2 News.